Big win for the Fighting Hawks here tonight as they finish up their home schedule. 75-68 over Northern Colorado. Mitch Wigness alongside the cheerful person of the week, Val Sussex. Uh, a big win there for North Dakota. Just sum up uh, a big win for UND. Yeah, it, it was fantastic. They got a lot of, North Dakota had a lot of contribu contribution from each member of the team and the seniors had a big night on senior night and the crowd was into the game. It was a really, really fun game to call and it was yeah. a great game to watch and it's, it's just a good day to be a North Dakota fan. 2,300 fans jam-packed this Betty Engelstead Sioux Center crowd and you mentioned, yeah, the seniors really had uh, their way tonight with Northern Colorado. Mikayla Dyer, her first career double-double, 17 points, 11 rebounds. Let's get to the highlights here as the uh, the first half. Well, it was a slow start for both teams, but UND started to get some momentum here at the end of the first quarter. Yeah, it really was. Northern Colorado started off hot. They had their scoring scoring, scoring going, and then Mikayla Dyer kind of said, oh, not on my senior day, and she really took over. Uh, leading scorer for the game today does a little bit of everything, and, and she had some help, too. She had some teammates some seniors like Sam Roscoe. Sam was really clicking on all cylinders. She was hitting shots from the outside, hitting shots from the inside, just doing all the little things that she needed to do to be successful. Mikayla Dyer, you look at it, the last three home games, she's combined for 68 points. Here's three of them right here. Yeah, Mikayla has range, and if, if you don't think she's going to shoot from up there, you better think again. And then you've got players like Fallon Freegy, Jill Morton, Lexi Claybo, those sensational sophomores that UND has. Uh, it's pretty fun to see. You know that North Dakota's losing some seniors. Last home game for them, uh, but the future is bright for this North Dakota team. If anything, this game proved, who do you stop on this UND team? I think the answer is you can't stop everyone. No, you definitely can't, and North Dakota had that in their game plan. Uh, holding their leading scorer down. She was 3 for 22 from the field, number 10, Savannah Smith. But um, if you don't have a player like that, you can't just stop one player. So North Dakota has a nice uh, quartet, if you will, of players that can really score the ball. UND stretched the lead out, and uh, Northern Colorado, give them credit, they wouldn't go away quietly as uh, they whittled this one all the way down to five in the closing minutes on a tough take there. You mentioned that she was just 3 of 22 with Savannah Smith, but a couple tough takes there in the final quarter. But... UND, just when the chips are on the line, they've been the most impressive team this season. Yeah, North Dakota's been in that position so many times, and they just find a way to win.